going to this welcome welcome this is jackie aka fabulous jackie all right guys so i am getting ready for church i'm wearing this mango dress i found in my closet you guys remember this and um pair of my vince camulo boots like another old of your goodies so i didn't do Try to get ready but i'm just going to show you my church outfit so we are at the way i'm wearing this beautiful set matching cuff so i'm gonna do my v glasses because i want something light on my hair i will be carrying my my Kors bag remy gave me for mother's day last year it was either this or because this seems so heavy maybe i just carry this little lovely bag and anyway guys so and then i know it's cold outside so i might just throw that on my neck and now um, i'll do this big house tooth gold jacket by focus 2000 Because of the jacket, I don't think this yeah, it could actually. Hmm. Okay. I think we'll carry this for now. Alright guys, so I'll see you when I get there. Bye. This one, you don't yeah. sucker for two. <laughs> Just give me one. I told you, I might take this water with me. I'm super thirsty. The mercy never ceasing, call for songs of boundless praise. Teach me some harmonious Sunday, sung by flaming tongues above. Praise the mount I'm fixed upon it, mount of thy redeeming love. Thou hast drawn 
guys, we are Starbucks. We left church. And I stopped the Marshalls for a minute. Because I wanted some shortbread cookies. They have the best shortbread cookies at Marshalls. But I detoured and got me some Rizzo trench coat that I needed a large though. All they had was a medium and an extra large, but I took the extra large because it's more, you know, more trenchy. Got a hoodie. See, Rachel Zoe be killing it now. Y'all be dying for Zara. You should shop Rachel Zoe at Marshalls or TJ Maxx. Super, super cute. So, and I think I got a couple of Bottega tote bags. Yay. Why is it hot? Because it's hot. <laughs> so maybe I shouldn't get a hot drink. Do they have yeah, a latte? I thought you were going to get like a... Yeah, a remember you latte? did that last time? They did? Yeah. Okay. It was iced. It was an iced like uh, creme brulee? Mm hmm Is it creme brulee? Or, yeah, yeah. Creme brulee. Not creme brulee. Latte. Latte. Ice. ice. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to get it. It's, it's hot. They said it was going to be super cold today. But when we got out of church, it was kind of cold, wasn't it? A little bit, yeah. If people could just but, push up a little bit, I could place my order. Yeah. Ooh. I'm gonna hit him. The, the car over there needs to look. I'm way back here. <laughs> if they could move up a little bit, but can you hear me though? I can hear you. You can hear me? Okay. So let me get a grande cafe vanilla frap. Cafe vanilla frap. And a tall caramel brulee latte iced. I'm sorry, but our uh, calculation is continuing now. There's no more. What's continued? It's discontinued. Uh, There's no more caramel brulee. Our calculation is continued. We have to wait until next, uh, next year. Stop. Or the end of this year. Oh, okay. Okay. So what's close to that I can get? Some kind of brulee. I mean, some. Let's see what he has. Wait. There isn't really anything close. I guess the this would be like a dark caramel latte. Nah. I wanna um I wanna brew caramel brew. What's the other thing they have? Let me look in your app. Okay, well before let me think about it, but let me get a a tall dick of Americano hot. With Yeah, with two splendid and half and half. What did I get? Brew? Yes. And then um there's a caramel brulee cream. They don't have oh, a brulee. Oh, um, okay. I want a cold I want a cold brew. Some kind of cold brew. What what do they have for the brew? Yeah, yeah, I'm looking. Hold on, I'm trying to get my drink. I got everybody's name here so I can see what I want. Uh what did I used to get the brew? Uh um, cinnamon cinnamon caramel cream cold brew. Is it cinnamon or doje caramel cold brew? Cinnamon. Can I get this uh, tall cinnamon car caramel cold brew? Yes. Yeah. Okay. That's what it is then. And do you have any butter croissants? Yes, we do. Can I get two? Can you warm it, warm it up for croissant? me, please? Yes. Can you heat okay. them up? Of course. Real good. Yeah, we got you. Anything uh, else? That's it. Thank you. Thank you. Can I have a name for the order? Jackie. Hey Jackie, I will see you at the window for 2155. Alright, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, because I remember that's what you used to get all the yeah, time. Yeah, I kind of forgot what it was. I've been stuck on that caramel brulee. They tell me I gotta wait till next year to get a brulee. Jesus, Starbucks. Why do you bring these drinks and then take them away? I know they're seasonal there. The season ain't over. It's still cold out here. Anyway, you got your app? I wonder if oh, we yeah. have any free drinks. The water is better than some coffee. Let's see you guys. We got the cold brew. I have a tiny. This is so teeny tiny though. Teeny tiny brew. Mm. This is. Uh, I might just spell my name with a Y, oh, yeah, Jackie. With a Y. <coughs> Cinnamon caramel cold brew. A little. I think all the sweetness in the middle. Still a little bit of 
Maybe I'll get this truck just to scare it. Right. Thank you. Can I get napkins? Yeah. Thank you. I don't want to lick our fingers now. Why did they ask me everything? Thank, Thank you. you. Have a good one. You too. Nice drink, really. box. So good. Give me a microphone if you don't mind. Don't give me some dry croissant. I'm like, oh no, gotta heat this up, baby. Gotta be soft. Yeah, Xavier did a really good job. Yeah, He's the only one that understands. Yeah, understands the assignment. They be trying to give me some dry croissant. Oh, More like lukewarm croissant. Mm -hmm. Not even uh, hot. Did you hit it up? No. I put it from one minute. If that. Maybe two seconds. This is good. Nice and soft. Hey guys, welcome. We are back home. Welcome back. As I get my stuff together, let's sit down and chit chat. Do a little bit of show and tell. Church was good, guys. Church was really good. Pastor was very engaging. I went to my other church that's close by. Because I didn't feel like driving that far to go to the church. I usually like to go to the other church if I feel like I want to catch the Holy, Holy Ghost, Holy Spirit. But today I just kind of felt a little bit settled. So I figured I should go to the church close to home. Remy was baptized in this church. So guys, we're home. And we are here in a boudoir, a humble abode. This light is too bright, so I don't know. I don't be knowing. But anyway, guys, so I want to thank everybody that stopped by yesterday. I appreciate you guys. And um, God bless you. I appreciate all the support you guys are giving me, including watching my daughter's movie, Deadbeat on on Tubi. If you're here and you haven't seen the movie, my late daughter I wrote a I wrote a little movie and produced and he's the she was the producer and the writer. So the movie just I think the um it was streaming. I think Tubi was the first person to buy the movie. So it's playing on Tubi. It's free. Tubi is free. Mo most movies on Tubi are free. So if you want to go watch it. I think if you get the app, then it will be ad free. I'm not sure. But Tubi is free. So the movie is called Dead Beat. So please support. I appreciate you. If you haven't watched it, please go watch it. I know today is the Super Bowl. Nobody's going to watch anything, but you never know. I'm not a Super Bowl girl. I'm actually going to braid my hair in a couple of hours. My lady's coming to braid my hair. I'm probably going to be sitting there for six hours. But shish. All right, guys. So this is so bright. Let me see if I can reduce it a little bit. Yeah. 
yeah much better so yes guys um we always pay homage to our new items that we consider luxury or dupe or some items don't belong here but being that i show my luxury pieces and pieces that i love that are dear to me they're in this room this is my happy place my my boudoir my everything so this is where we are guys i am still thankful for you guys helping me out through these hard times you know my grieving period is almost gonna be a year coming next month and it seems like it was just a month ago when you know shit happened but march 3rd is gonna make it a whole year but you know through the lord is my strength my daughter sent me this plaque while i was thrifting last week she wanted me to have this because this was her bible verse this is what she used to read to her grandma gave her this verse and you know her bible in her apartment always had this vest lo and behold i went to goodwill and this plaque was sitting right there psalm 27 verse 1 the lord is my light and my salvation the lord is the strength of my life that's what she always prayed before she went to bed and the fact that i was able to find this plaque at goodwill i can't to me she sent that to me to know that god is my strength which is what i'm doing God is my strength. I know some people go like, how is she doing it? God is my strength. Without God, I will be falling apart in tiny little pieces. But I know she's with me and I'm happy. And I know she's smiling up in heaven, watching her movie, people streaming it, watching it. I really appreciate you guys. It's, it's like so overwhelming how many people are watching that movie. And I'm thankful and I know she's proud. So that's just what it is there is good I'm, <laughs> I'm giving i'm passing the touch to remy to try to do a part two of this movie because he's in the acting field that's what he's getting his masters on so we shall see nothing i'm not gonna put pressure on him but he's gonna take his time he said he wants to do it so that will be something i will help him through and i will get some professionals to help him through it's probably sometime next year right now it's still a little raw all right guys enough of this sad story let's do why we came here i don't really have any luxury bag to show you guys but i have a luxury some luxury pieces or designer i have one luxury and one designer piece i got from uptown cheapskate yesterday actually this is this is a michael cause this don't belong here but they didn't have a bag so this is where I put all the stuff. I bought this bag. It's a beautiful tote. But being that they were going bagless, they decided. I told them, just put it in here. So I did get a pair of Zara loafers for like $9. Brand new. Never been used from uptown. You guys, you know, they cut the tags up of this of stuff that is final sale. A Zara woman. I, it's just beautiful loafers super cute it will look good with a suit nice i don't do flat heels but i did not mind this size eight for nine dollars brand new zara piece i was gonna pick it up that's why i love uptown cheapskate sometimes their prices are like huh what and then sometimes they are way up there then you'll be like what are you smoking but this zara with the grommets I love. I got that for nine dollars. Nine dollars. And then I did get this Michael Kors. This was only twenty nine dollars. I need. It's kind of new. New inside. Something else is in here. Oh yeah, this is the Zara. She left the Zara tag in there. Nine nine ninety nine. I see it fell off. So this is so clean and new. I got this. Super cute. So when I got home, I realized why this bag was only twenty nine dollars. 
one of the straps here is a little off you know look like it was gonna come off but it's a simple thing my cobbler will charge me five dollars to reinforce that it's a nice shopping tote and it is like a purple blonde nice color michael Kors. it's not my thing but what did i do with the other michael Kors bag i was gonna wear today but you know for that price i picked it up i'm like whoa wait a minute now i can use that to shop with okay the next item i got is a brand new it's designer Stuart Weitzman is designer to me it's not luxury or we could consider it semi-luxury got this beautiful Stuart Weitzman boots made in Spain right here guys I paid I actually left the tag on there I paid $7.99 for a brand new Stuart Weitzman. Brand spanking new. I'll be like, what? You can tell it came out of a major store because then they peeled out the store. Probably Nostrums. They peeled out the tag out of here. And it's a it's an eight and a half, which was my size. I was shook it when I saw $7.99. <laughs> Not even that the real real Stuart Weitzman is super expensive at the real real, but fact that they mark this i don't know if you could see it on the inside sword whites man for 7.99 how was it going argue i was like oh 7.99 super cute ankle i love the heel it's not too high so yeah that was my uptown cheapskate buy Stuart Weitzman for $7.99. Come on now. I, I had gotten, I don't know if you guys had seen this, my other Stuart Weitzman. And this one, this is the older one. I had gotten this from the real real for like $50. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then I had gotten this, the new Stuart Weitzman. You can tell by the, the color of the tag. And uh, I got this from from Ross. It was on sale for sixty nine dollars because they wanted one nineteen. But this is how Stuart Weitzman be like expensive. So getting those boots that was something that I really was like, oh wow, okay. All right, let me fix my dress. So those are the things I got from Uptown Chipscape. Oh, I've got to put the, let's put myself out there a little bit. So, those are the only things, oh wait, no, I got a luxury item. Gee, this, it's not a bag, but it's a shirt, it's a Gucci, Gucci shirt, men's button down, size 42. So we got the Gucci shirt. All the buttons says Gucci on there. I don't know if you can see how small they are, but it says Gucci. It's more like a dinner shirt. Size, size 42. When I saw it, it was hanging with all the designer pieces. There was a Gucci jacket right next to it. And I'd be like, what is here it is right here made in made in italy gucci i don't know if you could see that right there made in italy and uh, yeah size 42 which is a 16 and a half neck it's uh it's supposed to have a cuff but i think the cuff is missing that's why they were able to sell it for so let me put it in a hanger because it's not it's not doing any favors i mean let me let me hang it up so you guys get to see it So when 
and I saw the price. It was a DNG denim jacket, which I should have gotten, but I was on my way to go pay for my little stuff. And uh, you know, I'm always looking for a black shirt. When I saw this Gucci shirt, it's supposed to have a cuff, but the cuff, the cuff links, it's supposed to have a cuff links, but I think somebody took those or that's how it was donated without the cuff links. And you can see all the buttons here, right here says gucci right there beautiful kind of stretchy so i will style this very well and how much did i pay for this gucci tell me she left the tag 27 dollars that was 29 but 27 dollars is what i paid for the gucci 20 27 right there Yep, it was hanging with all the luxury pieces. So I'll be like, wait a minute now. Huh? I can use. Let me go. Sometimes you can find Prada in there. They have DNG. They have Versace. You guys remember, I think I bought the, um, what's it called? The Garçon pants that I bought there. I have, and it's probably going to wear with this Gucci shirt. Was it come the Garçon? It was either come the Garçon. And then I bought Versace pants so this will even be way expensive by the real real so pick that up at uptown chipscape little gucci shirt that was my luxury piece for uptown chipscape for the day So St. John Lava, there's bad news for you. <laughs> Not really bad news. She didn't have no more CC t-shirts. They were all gone. So she made me understood, like around the beginning of the month, where some people get their money from the government. She sells a lot. Like everything is gone. So today is the 10th. She was pretty much wiped out, like totally wiped out. The only thing she had were, was a CC sweater. And you wanted a t-shirt, so. And she wanted $65 for the sweater. So I was like, nah, I am have to ask her if she wants it. It's a black sweater with white CCs. So she didn't really, she didn't really have much. She was, and uh, Vicky, the same thing, because I know you wanted it. Then she told me the best time for me to check is towards the end of the month when she will get new merchandise. But for now, she tries to get stuff like towards the end of the month so that when the beginning of the month get, gets here, so people come and they buy her stuff because that's when they get their money. At the end of the month or the beginning of the month. I don't know. But she had no more CC t-shirts at all. She had a white one. But I was trying to look at it. It's white with a little bit of cc on there but uh the stretch didn't look like it was gonna give that was the only thing she had and she wanted uh 55 for that and i was like mm, she might not like it so unfortunately that's the bad news no more no more of the of the hat either and i'm i'm not gonna part with this she had this same hat but it had like a prada logo on there in a, in a tan color, not in black. So, hopefully, the beginning, end of the month, she'll get new stuff, and then, you know, I will let you know. That's just hide. I'm so sorry for that. I made a trip after I left yesterday. I was like, let me go take care of this, because I was going to go buy my braiding hair, and it's really not too far from where she's at, and she did not have much. She had been cleaned out. I was able to find this little t-shirt for myself the dng super cute the dolce and gabbana kind of look like men's i would say it's a men's shirt i tried to show remy it's a size large oh what is that i just noticed some it has a little has a little stain on there i didn't notice that the other day 
Yeah, it looks like a men's shirt, but it looks like it will be small for Remy, but I'll have him try it on if he likes it. It says size large, but I didn't like the fact that it had a little stain on it. So, ow, ow, ow. So, that's what I got from her. And, um, the little CC crystal, um, this is for Sandra. She had the teeniest, tiniest little stud. Let me get it. Because she did not have the red, you know, this, I, I think you want like the standard small one, but she had a micro. Everything else was sold out. So you need to let me know if you still want it or not because they were sold out. And um, it just says crystals because you wanted the diamonds. But it's, it's very teeny tiny. So that's it. That's what she had. Nothing else. The other regular size ones were all sold out. Listen, like I tell you, in the beginning of the month, People be shopping. The people that get their little money from the government, they go crazy shopping. And those of us who spend a hard earned money will be like, where is this? Where is that? And she looked at me like, it's gone. And I'll be like, ugh. And I'll be like, did you like having a sale? She says, no, it's the beginning of the month. Stop sales. I'm like, okay. So on my way out of church, I stopped at Marshall's to get me some shortbread cookies because these walkers shortbread cookies ha 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 it's only 70 uh, calories these are good my husband eats them like there's no tomorrow so me and remy too when we're watching the super bowl snacking and when she's doing my hair this is what i'll be munching on so i went to marshall's because that's what they, during christmas time they had so many of this i was like yay so i went there and while I was there, you guys will see it. I think I, I try, I, I'm going to insert the little video. I found this um, Rachel Zoe. Oh, ah, excuse me, moi. I have allergies, guys. So if you hear me sniffing and sneezing, I have allergies. Time of year for me. This beautiful double-breasted trench coat, guys. It almost reminds me of my Fendi. It's by Rachel Zoe. Don't sleep on Rachel Zoe. It has a hoodie that is deta detachable. You could take that off if you don't want all that excess. Beautiful trench. So I was there trying to find a large. They had a medium and they had extra large. This is the extra large. It was only $39 for what this is. Super heavy, super cute. You know, if you were to go to Zara, you probably pay $199 or $2, 219 to something. Only if you catch it on sale, then you probably pay $79 or $99. But Rachel Zoe, I'm your advocate. I love Rachel Zoe, okay? Rachel Zoe, if you, if you watch me, just know that I love everything that you do. I love her blazers. I love... <sighs> Right now, she has this two-piece pajama kind of silky tops, full-legged silky pants with a matching top. Ah, it's just so early. I was going to buy that, but then I said to myself, self, you might want to wait a little bit because they might mark it down because Marshalls is good for marking down stuff like. So I feel like maybe after Valentine's Day, I will pick those pieces. But this trench coat, I could not leave it behind because I know it's going to be marked down at some point. But... I picked it up for thirty nine dollars. I'm like, I ain't waiting. Spring is right around the corner. This is going to come handy. It's water resistant, and I was so happy. It has a slit in the back. Does it? Yes, it does have a slit. 
that is sewn but you know we have to always cut that little x where some people just walk around with the x in the back i'm like what is that cut it up i just want to go back there and say excuse me <laughs> that's not meant for that's not the style of the jacket that's just to keep the the slit the opening together so it's not it doesn't fold then when you buy it you gotta cut it up anywho so while i was there i went to the handbag section and i found some dupes okay i found a jody dupe in this color you guys remember i had some from early showroom but this blue one this is a Bottega dupe. This is by same brand that I have downstairs. Urban Accessories. But this one is super. I love the light blue color. It can you can wear it with denim. You can dress it up. This is the other ones I got from LA Showroom were just a little, a little flimsy. But no, too big, too big a wallet. I'm trying to put some stuff in here, maybe little wallets, and see how. Because so, the other one, when you put stuff in there, the ones I got from Ellie Showroom, it kind of drops and then makes the handle a little longer. But this is the same brand, I have a black one by urban accessories just downstairs i got from la showroom too it's still there but this one stays do we see this bag do you see how beautiful it is and i love the fact that you don't get to see the reverse side of the weave it stays intact super cute they only had this in this blue i was like where is there a black one but all they had with this was this one Either that, I was just a little bit too late. Maybe if I go to TJ Maxx, they might have it. Because Marshalls and TJ Maxx and Home Goods, they're brothers and sisters. So, TJ Maxx is the big sister. Marshalls is nobody. It's still a, a little sister. Home Goods is just that sister that is doing their own thing. But they're all one big family. So, like I can use a gift card from tj maxx i could use it at marshall's vice versa so yeah and i've done that before i was like gift card is going to the same people can i use my tj maxx gift card yeah they'll be like sure same company yeah credit cards are all the same too all right so i got that and this was only 29 dollars. so if you have a marshall's next to you Go check it out. I think I will have Remy. Do I link a Marshalls? Is it? Do you do? Can you link a discount store item? Do they have a link? I didn't get this online, so I don't know about all this linking stuff. All I know is just go to Marshalls and, you know, mosey on in the handbag section and get your beautiful Bottega dupe bag. You didn't have to pay the Bottega price. Let me see my real Bottega wool woven bag let me see how the how it looks okay the only thing is my real Bottega this wave is a little smaller but it's tight I don't know if that's how they made it for the Jody bag I'm not sure but oh well I like it. You know. These are. Yeah, these are the flimsy ones. These are the ones I got from LA showroom, even though I sold a lot. Is this urban? Let's see who makes this. This is still new. I have gotten this from LA Showroom. This one is a little flimsy. But I love the color though. So when you put stuff in this one, it kind of drops like this. 
you know, while this one stays. So yeah, this is, let me see the weave. Mm, kind of different. All right. This is supposed to be downstairs, but I, I think I needed a pink little jewelry bag and I brought this up here. So I don't know if I'm still going to leave it up here. I might have to take that one downstairs. And then there is this. This one is still downstairs, I think. Now, this is the one that I feel like it's just like the handle, and this one is a little looser. Why right, this one is a little tough. Now, the one, the urban accessory one, I just got from Marshalls. It's a little bigger and it's more, more structured as compared to this one's. But all in all, these are some cute little Jody dupes. But this is the one I got today. This is denim. You can wear this with denim. It's not denim, but it's like a denim color, light blue. So check it out at your Marshalls. Then if you want this ones, you can check my boutique downstairs i think i was selling them for at the same price like 30 dollars or so but those are good dupes i love this because i don't have that many light blue bags i just don't so go to your marshals the next one is this another bottega dupe same who makes this one no this one is is by en expressions nyc en expression nyc assembly crafted luxury vegan handbag oh okay they call this luxury oh okay expressions nyc even the zipper this is cute so they had this in this beautiful red for valentine's day then they have it in the pink oh what's this oh 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 it actually has a chain what it has a chain where you can hang it out i did not know that i didn't even look up inside the bag i just saw the bags they were all up front and i was like what is this cute see and they have it in a light pink it says it says e what does this say right here e slash n expressions nyc right there and then it does have it on the zipper so you know how i was doing my little valentine's day haul and i was struggling to what bags i will carry do we see this beautiful bag it's not leather it's full leather they let you know straight up but it's a luxury it's vegan friendly vegan approved yeah and this was the same price 29 dollars. i don't know why i didn't grab the pink of that because i love it's baby pink looking at my closet I have fuchsia. I don't have a light baby pink. Oh, I do. I have one Chanel cocoa handle, I believe. So let's see why they gave us a chain for this bag. I mean, I don't know why, but let's just see how it looks with a chain. Voila, they gave you that little part right there. I personally would not use a chain but let's just see how it will look with the chain and i'm gonna put some stuff in there so we can see voila do we need the chain though do we really need the chain no we don't need the chain let me put some stuff in there
The thing about this herb, uh, this little Bottega bags, they are opening or Duke bags, their openings are so little. You cannot, I don't know if a big wallet, you will have a struggle with a big wallet. You have to use a smaller wallet. See, like I'm putting all my tiny wallets in there. That's two wallets, change purse, sunglasses. Oh, hello. Let's see if it would zip. I might get a pink one. I love it. Super cute. Okay. OMG. I don't know if I need the chain. I don't know why the chain is there. I mean, do you want to do it as a crossbody? I guess if your hands are preoccupied they were like okay let me just do something let me put the chain on there but i like it without the chain so this too was 29 dollars the knot is just so good so guys why pay more when you could pay less and still get and still get the same the same look the same effect it's not like somebody's gonna stop you on the street and say, Oh, it's your bag, Bottega. <laughs> then you'll be like, Mind your business. Then you'll be like, No, but it's a beautiful tool from Marshalls. It's by E slash N Expressions. And they'll be like, Hmm, who's that? Don't know, but it's cute. <laughs> it's a conversational piece, okay? You're sitting there with your girlfriends and looking at your bag like, Girl. Did you just go buy a Bottega bag that be like, what do I look like? Mfufu, boobo the fool. Most of that other Bottega bag that I have, I had thrifted that and that's authentic. I ain't go to no Bottega store. Shit. My money stays in my bank. I have mortgage, insurance, all kinds of stuff. I have renovation to do with my money. I ain't got time to go take $3,000, $2,000 to buy a bag when... I could do so much. I can renovate something in this house, especially this closet. But anyway, look at this. I'm not saying though to you, girl, if you got it like that and you ain't got no responsibilities, I so much envy you. <sighs> I used to be that girl. But with age, you learn. You were like, wait a minute. Now, even when I work for Chanel, people don't get it wrong. I used to... <laughs> You know, just get some good dupes sometimes and people be looking at me. Oh my God, where'd you get that, Jackie? It's for me to know. Because if I tell you, I might, you know what? <laughs> so I always used to turn people's eyes because it's the way I carry my item. I don't let the item carry me. I don't need to come around with a expensive bag and then sashay my way around. I could take a $30 bag and sashay my way around and people would think I just dropped Three thousand. It's the confidence how you carry stuff. You're not walking around with a price tag, okay? If you dress nicely, let's like I say. If I go sit with my friends, I put this bag on the counter. They're sitting there thinking, okay, Jackie, what is that? It's a conversational piece, right out of Marshalls. You don't have to break the bank. All right, guys. Enough of my wahala. I think this is all I have to show you on a Sunday. And then I don't have anything else. So I went to church today wearing this dress from Mango. You guys remember I found this in my closet. Did not know I, I still had it because I had bought it during COVID. And it still fits me. I love it, love it. And I have on my feet, I wore this thigh high um croc boots by i think it's sam elderman or vince Camuto. no it's sam elderman sorry i thought it was vince thigh high i put a socks right here so for some reason i didn't want to show my knee because the dress is a little short and i was going to church i want to be showing all that so that's how i went to church today and then on my neck they said it was going to be cold i through this uh, Louis Vuitton um, scarf that I had thrifted, authentic. You guys remember that? Got from American Way. And then uh, on my neck, 
I have my statement piece necklace with a matching earring. And then we have the cuff. I'm just trying to give it that little goddess look, more like a queen, like the African queen that we are. So I figured, you know, why not look the part? And then I have my watch and some bracelets. So I have on my houndstooth outer jacket, but I think I checked. It was, I came home and I just checked it in the room. You guys will see it in the, in the beginning heavy duty and um i was wearing this v um sunglasses where did i get this from i think maybe timu these sunglasses they almost look like valentino but i have the real valentino but this was just something that caught my eye because i love it i wore that and bag of choice is this lv I wish I had my jacket. So this is how I went to church today. This is my Sunday's best. And I was smelling like um I came here in a hurry. I decided to do the YSL black opium. <sighs> this thing is two years old when it first came out, and it's still full. Sometimes I forget I have it, maybe because of the bottle is so black. I reach for other things and I leave the Saint Laurent black opium behind. And I remember when we went to the store one day, my husband goes like, do you want, we were looking at all YSL perfumes. And he says, you want a black opium? I say, you already bought this for me like a while back. So I, my bottle is still full. Look at that. Anywho. Yeah. So... That's that. My lipstick is still fenty. Still looking for the red. I'm waiting for Alta to open by my house so I can go get a beautiful red lipstick. Actually looking for a YSL one that's all red or I don't know who else. Um, but it has to be red. I know YSL used to have so beautiful red lipstick when I work retail. I used to wear that a lot. But I haven't been to a major department store to go get that so yeah that's it guys that is my show and tell for today and um, my girl is coming to braid my hair around three o'clock so i gotta go get myself ready and then we can watch the super bowl and yeah i think what we're eating today we have some chicken that you know the rositori chicken i got from smart and final i am um, i made some red tomato pepper sauce on the side i'm gonna have remy ball some rice and that's what we're gonna eat today and i got my snacks my walkers strawberry cookies and i can drink some wine with this and pretend like i'm enjoying the super bowl but i really don't give a two hoots i know some people it's now it's no longer um travis kelsey kelsey whatever his name is it's now taylor swift People, they're asking people on the news today, who are you ruling for? They'll be like, I'm a Swifty, Taylor Swift. Is Taylor Swift playing people? How vain are you guys? That poor guy, that girl has came and took his shine away. Okay? For the Chiefs, the, the, the Kelsey guy or whatever his name is, Travis. You're no longer Travis, you're now Taylor Swift. That's what people were saying today. Oh, I'm ruling for Taylor Swift. I'm like, Taylor Swift? Is Taylor Swift playing? I would be mad if I was him. You're losing your identity, Mr. Kelsey. You really are. They're going to start calling you Mrs. Mr. Taylor Swift. <laughs> Whew, that's what you get dealing with celebrities. Then anyway, guys, if you're a Swifty, you know what? Stay over there. Don't come for me. I just think it's ridiculous that they take this guy. They've been training so hard. They've forgotten his name. Now they're calling. I'm, I'm ruling for Taylor Swift. Not i personally don't care who wins but if i was to choose it would be the 49ers because i'm sick and tired of the taylor swift mess she ain't playing okay she's not so stop taking away from the people that are busting their ass out there call their names and stop saying you're swifty so you're ruling for taylor swift is she playing come on now why are we so vain why do we idolize people 
they are people at the end of the day they're like you and me okay we don't have their money but guess what we don't know the kind of troubles they're having okay so stop it all right guys you know what Jackie likes to come up with some wahala, okay? If you don't know that, I do a lot of wahala, I do. And wahala means trouble. <laughs> but in a good way. Ha! Yes. You'll be like, oh, yeah, she goes with her wahala. That means here she goes with her trouble-talking mess. But anyway, guys, so I'll see you later. I don't know. Maybe I'll do. I will show you where I'm braiding my hair a little bit. If not, this is it. I love you, and I'll see you later. Peace.